Hi guys, in this video we are going to learn how to write algorithm to print all natural numbers from 1 to n and draw flowchart for it. Here we have to print all natural numbers from 1 to n. What is natural number? Natural number is starting from 1. It is a whole positive number starting from 1, 2, 3 and so on. Alright. First we are going to write algorithm. Algorithm is a step by step process to solve a problem. In this question we have to print a natural number from all natural numbers from 1 to n. 1 to n. Algorithm. Algorithm is always start with start statement. So step 1 is start. Step 2. Here we have to print all natural number from 1 to n, right? So here we have to read n value, variable n value. Read n. Next step 3. In step 3 we have to declare the value of i. Initially it is i. Declare i value is equal to 1. Step for in step 4 we have to print the value of i that is 1 right we have to print all natural number from 1 to n right so initially we have to print value of i that is 1 right so here print i next in initially we print i right what is the value of i 1 right so here we printing value of 1 next we have to increase the value of i that is i is equal to i plus 1 that is i plus 1 means i value is equal to what is the value of i 1 right value of i is 1 1 plus 1 i value become 2 in step 6 we have to check if i value less than or equal to n if i value less than or equal to n if it is true then go to step 4 go to step number 4 here in step number 4 we have to print the value of i what is the value of i it is changed right 2 now it is 2 so here we printing initially 1 next 2 next step in step 5 in step 4 we have to print the value of i that is 2 next we have to increase the value of i that is i is equal to i plus 1 i value is equal to i plus 1 what's the value of i 2 right 2 plus 1 i value become 3 in next in step 6 again we have to check if i value less than or equal to n consider i n value is equal to 6 here i value is 3 right 3 less than or equal to 6 true right so again then go to step number 4 again we have to print the value of i that is 3 right it become 1 2 3 next we have to increase the value of i i is equal to i plus 1 4 right 4 is less than or equal to n. 4 is n value is 6, right? If it is 4 less than or equal to 6, true, right? Then go to step number 4. Here we have to print i value. It becomes 4, right? i value is 4. Next, it will repeat until i value less than or equal to n. If this condition is false, it is come out of this step. It goes to step number 7. Here we have to stop the algorithm using stop statement. Step 1, it is start with start statement. In step 2, we have to read the value of n. In step 3, we have to declare i is equal to 1. Initially, i value is equal to 1. In step 4, we have to print the value of i. Initially, it is 1. In step number 5, we have to increase the value of i. That is equal to i is equal to i plus 1. 
i is equal to i plus 1 in step 6 we have to check if i value less than or equal to n if it is true it goes to step number 4 else it is goes to step number 7 that is stop statement finally we have to stop the flow algorithm using stop statement algorithm is start with start statement and end with stop statement Next, we are going to draw flowchart. Flowchart is a graphical representation of solved problem. Flowchart. It is start with start statement. It is writing within an oval shape. Next, we have to read input value. It is input values is writing within a parallelogram shape. Within that, we have to write read n value. Next, next we have to declare the value of i, right? It is writing within a rectangular shape. Within that, we have to declare i is equal to 1. Initial, it is 1. Next, we have to print the value of i, right? Print i value. Output value is writing within a parallelogram shape. Next, we have to increase the value of i. Operation is done within a rectangular shape. i is equal to i plus 1. Next, we have to check if i value less than or equal to n. Condition is writing within a diamond shape if i value less than or equal to n. If it is true, it goes to print i value. Next, i is equal to i plus 1. Next, if, if it is false, if again it will check if i less than or equal to n. If this condition is false, It stop the flowchart using stop statement. So guys, this is the flowchart to print all natural numbers from 1 to n. It is start with star statement. Next, we have to read n value. It is writing within a parallelogram shape. Next, we have to declare i value. Declaration is writing within a rectangular shape. Next, we have to print i value. Here output value is writing within a parallelogram shape. Next we have to increase the value of i that is i is equal to i plus 1. Next we have to check if i value less than or equal to n. Here conditions is writing within a diamond shape. So here if check if i value less than or equal to n. If this condition is true again we go to go back to print value of i print the value of i if it is false we have to stop the flowchart using stop statement here start and stop statement writing within a oval shape input and output values is writing within a parallelogram shape declaration and process is writing within a rectangular shape your condition is writing within a diamond shape so guys, this is the flowchart to print all natural number from 1 to n. Thank you for watching. If you like my video, please like and subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.